Hello and welcome to another Sitefinity feature series video. In this video I'll cover enabling the Health Check Service API Endpoint. The Health Check Service API Endpoint provides information about basic and vital functions of your Sitefinity CMS site. First we'll need to edit our web config for our project. In order to enable the Health Check Service, we must first add the following line to our App Settings section of our web.config file. The value for this key is the path that will be used to access the RESTful API endpoint. We'll access our RESTful API via REST API slash health. Next, after saving our file, we'll need to restart our web service. After restarting our web service, we'll then navigate to Administration and then to Settings. We'll then click Advanced. We'll scroll down to System. And then at the bottom of the menu, we'll have a Health Check service. We'll then click Enable Health Check Service and save our settings. Now I'll make use of a REST client to verify our Health Check Service is working correctly. In this case I'm using Postman, but you can use a REST client of your own. I simply append the route configured in the web config setting to my Sitefinity URL and call a simple GET request. As you can see, the default two health check settings for bootstrapped and startup finish are working correctly. Now let's add another check to the API. Now we'll navigate to the health check section and create a new health check. How about one for databases? For the type field, we'll use a pre-configured Sitefinity check. There are more of these available and they can be found in the documentation in the link below in the comment section. Now that we've created our DB health check, we need to restart our IIS service. Now we can verify our database check. And now you can see that DB health and our database is up and healthy. Thanks for watching. For more videos, click the link for the What's New page of Sitefinity.com in the comments section below.